Fall isn't even here yet, but doctors at area hospitals are already seeing many fall-like illnesses. Leslie Rohde tells us what's going around. RSV is a respiratory illness that can be serious. It affects mostly children, and doctors tell us it's showing up early this year. At Dell Children's Medical Center in East Austin, ER physicians see a trend they usually don't see until late November. RSV, a respiratory virus that causes fever, coughing and congestion, and sometimes wheezing. Antibiotics don't help, and in severe cases, children have swelling in the airwaves and need to be hospitalized and put on a ventilator. Children who have obvious respiratory distress, high fevers that go on for more than three days and look more ill than they would look with a cold do need to see, be seen by a physician, particularly the very young children under a year old. Flu-like illnesses are keeping physicians like Dr. Jonathan Connor busy at St. David's Georgetown Hospital, although the cases have not tested positive for the flu. In northwest Austin at Jollyville Pediatrics, Dr. Evelyn Spencer reports treating children bothered by upper respiratory infections, allergies, and strep throat. At St. David's Round Rock Medical Center, Dr. Daniel McKay says allergies to pollen and mold are what's going around. And at Kyle, at St. David's Urgent Care, pink eye is prevalent. Dr. Crocker over at Dell Children's tells us they have not had any confirmed flu cases yet, but he says this is a good reminder for everyone to go get that flu shot. Remember, the CDC is recommending everyone over the age of six months get the shot, and the sooner, the better. Look for more stories concerning your health online at kxan.com. Leslie Rohde, KXAN, Austin News.